All right, guys, I got a real sick download. I don't know if you guys ever seen, um, what's this show called? Criminal Minds. It was a guy who was like fixated on like the Bible verses in, in the Bible. And he would basically read the scriptures, but he would be penalizing people. Now, this guy had um, cameras in several people's homes and basically, um, he was like monitoring them and seeing what they were doing in their homes. And he had some sort of hostage. Yeah, he had um, he had Spencer, younger white dude, um, white dude, skinny. But he was like he was real, real like educated, smart. And he basically tied them up to a chair, and he said, um, "I got." cameras and this and he put all he showed them all the people that he had on screen and he said which one of them would you want to die and he he said i i i don't know i can't pick i can't pick and you know because he basically was saying since spencer liked to save people basically you know now you're not going to be able to save them i got them on such and such and whatever so spencer was able to call the person and tell them like, oh, you know, it, well, the team will be able to call because of like how he was like spitting out the, the, the verses. But in modern day right now, whoever the person is that this is happening to, he's able to communicate to you telepathically to tell you what's going on. Take it as it resonates. Somebody about to go to court, though. It's somebody that's concerned. It's something somebody's been doing with Bible scriptures or verses, and they're upset. Like anybody who is out there helping people today, public figures, people who could actually speak, um, reach people, have them change their lives, official people. He's targeting these people, and I'm hearing he. This is somebody who's false, though. So I feel like I'm talking about a religious person who's very jealous. We got pathway. Yeah, he 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 built this path up. This could be a pastor. This could be a preacher. This could be whoever. Somebody's like faking to be. Um, they're going to jail. That's where they are going. It's it's somebody here who's like targeting people who's helping like influencers or pastors or preachers. People who are really into like whatever they're into, and it's like okay, well, you think you can save that person? Let's see if you can save them. It's something here that somebody's been doing here and they about to get stuck. Let me get a quick message on this though. Let me get a message on this. I feel like somebody's been doing this for a long time too. Somebody hates like honest, truthful people. They, they don't like saviors. It's like, who, who do you think you are to save? I'm gonna tag it down below what I'm talking about. See, we got the hermit. Look, with the four wands, I can never make it up. It's somebody who's been putting cameras in people's homes. With the nine of wands, is he wants people like fidgety, scared, or something on the edge. But I feel like whoever this person is, this could be a Virgo. He's now scared of his actions. He's scared. He had like a camera in somebody's home. Very jealous individual, whoever this is. He had a camera in somebody's home, and he was watching them. And he, he's like... um like basically telling people what his next move is going to be. Like after he does it, he's telling people before he does it. But he's causing fear tactics within the person who he's telling this to. This this is somebody who is psychotic more than likely. Um, and the police are on to him. This could be a cancer or a Taurus. It's like, okay, or or this could be happening to a Cancer or a Taurus. A Pisces could be significant or a Sagittarius. Somebody like, oh, you want to play Savior? It's something like that. Something to do with somebody playing Savior. And like I say here, whoever the person is, more than likely is some sort of teacher or leader or something like that. With the Four of Wands, this could be a pastor or a bishop, a synagogue or a church. Somebody's like targeting religious people or spiritual people, believers, I'm hearing. All right, this is going to be a short message here. Somebody's really worried about jail at this time. It's a light being shed. I also feel like whoever this person is, their home is being watched at this time. Somebody's home is being watched. Somebody's been, somebody told on somebody. Somebody was stalking an empress or something like that. 
and whoever the people are who who are trying to help or save people they try to burden them it, it they try to run scandals put them through scandals and stuff like that to see how they will be able to move forward with the ten of wands though it's an obstacle that somebody is experiencing right now something could be going on within somebody's family with the ten of wands to the ten of cups yeah, the three of wands. It's some sort of challenge or somebody's dealing with here. It could be their health that they're struggling with. The ten of pentacles or it could be their money. Um, others of you guys, somebody normally travels to do this. Somebody can't travel no more. It's like an investigation going on with this person. This person is not going to be able to travel. For some of y'all, somebody has went to possibly four to ten states doing what they do here. And I feel like this is against women. It's like somebody's like targeting like men or something like that. Men who help. But they this is an older man for some of y'all here. This this person got about to get a message. It's like an older man who's doing this to a younger man or yeah, somebody older is doing somebody is so stale, miserable, tight, cold. I'm getting the King of Swords energy. Somebody here, look, they in despair. They are in despair. But somebody is so frustrated with the way their life has went. And I'm hearing with women. This is a man who hates women for sure. So it's like whoever this man is, he's talking to this young man and he's telling him what his plans are to do with women. For some of y'all, he's already broken in multiple women's homes or something like that and stole. He steals from them great fortune. And these are high honor people or the woman who he most recently targeted is high honor. Something's going on with this masculine or it's about to. We got marriage. Main male. Is somebody targeting somebody's wife or, or future spouse? Somebody's interested in somebody here or something like that. They look at somebody as a wife, a, for, a, a, per, a, a future partner. And I know this sounds crazy, y'all, but these downloads I'll be getting is crazy. I'm telling you. It's somebody who's expecting to marry somebody. It's like I see a Virgo or this is the Aries Leo Sag. It's four of wands, ten of wands, three of wands with the hermit a virgo or fire sign somebody targets women they get in their homes they steal their valuables and all types of things and what they do is they place cameras in these women's homes god knows what they do with the camera footage but i feel like in this particular time somebody is showing somebody something or is a camera in somebody's home confirmation and i don't know what they plan to do see look somebody's wanting to court somebody wants to court or marry somebody here and this man gets in these women's homes and he do, he does god knows what and i feel like he's done it to at least four to ten women and see he changes his states he could he could move from state to state. He moves from state to state, or he does this in different states. This man could have multiple women in different states. False person could be under different aliases or something like that. He does this all the time. And he puts cameras in these homes. The Ten of Wands. Speaks about stress, burdens, obstacles, delays, five of swords. Somebody wants to stop somebody's journey here with a wife, a future wife. And this is by attacking them, the five of swords to the devil. Somebody has a secret, sick obsession with men. I'm, I'm, I'm getting like grounded, firm, solid, real tight men. They got a problem with this. And this man, whoever he is, he hates women. More than likely, he's targeting single women. This could be a Capricorn. He targets single women who are independent with the Nine of Pentacles. For some of y'all, he feels as though a man 
a woman should need a man or should have a man who who is this who is a woman to be single and self sufficient that's what i'm getting who is this woman four pentacles with the four of swords he likes to attack them when they're asleep that's what i'm getting this could be a cancer Somebody psychotic here. The chariot with the page of swords in reverse. Deals with depression issues. All right. Um, with the four of pentacles, somebody refused to change here. Ladies, these ways the rest or something like that. I don't know where this could be happening. Let's see though. What's the uh what's the what's the four of wands? What? Here I come. I'm coming. Give me one for the four of wands, please, y'all. I'm going to close this out. This is going to be quick. Give me one for the four of wands, please. The lovers. This could be a Gemini. Somebody loves somebody here. Somebody knows that. All right. Mm, 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 mm. Let's see. Somebody feels as though, somebody feels as though like they like a superhero or something um, with superpowers. This is a divorcee, Ten of Pentacles in reverse, um, or a masculine um, who feels as though he's been cheated out of life in some way, shape, or form. We got the Six of Pentacles to the lovers. I'm telling you, somebody wants to give somebody love here. They want to show somebody love or... Um, some of y'all, somebody wants to give you information about this. All right. This could be a tourist or is a tourist being watched at this time? We got the hybrid fine energy here, but I'm telling you, this is some sort of spiritualist teacher or cultist who really like spends a lot of their time protecting women. That's just what I'm getting. Somebody protects women. And whoever the person is, they like Queen of Wands in reverse. This Taurus does. They like Queen of Wands in reverse. Low vibing, um, feminines. Somebody could be with an Aries or a Leo right now. Or Virgo. Somebody likes low vibing women, very promiscuous. Um, women who are codependent, insecure, jealous, needy. This is who somebody likes or this is who somebody lives with or married to here. High priestess in reverse. Somebody who's very insecure. Um, somebody who does not use their intuition. Somebody deals with women like this. A Pisces could be significant here. Give me one for the Ten of Wands. Um, somebody's been hiding a secret and somebody's been playing a dirty game. But somebody here is about to tell. It's something a masculine has been doing with footage putting footage in women's home. This is to violate them, but this is to stress them out, make them feel fearful, not want to leave the house. A Aries masculine could be significant or Leo. We got the King of Wands who is burdened here. Um, somebody's very insulting to women. This is a masculine in an occult. Somebody likes to insult women, to burden them here. And for some of y'all, this, like I said, this is a false person. This is supposed to be some sort of leader, teacher, or a, a cultist or something like that here. Somebody's false. They like to violate women. The nine of swords. All right. So is it interference or some sort of blockage with somebody's plans here? What's the interference? The nine of wands is somebody behind bars or did they go behind bars recently or something like that somebody could have like some sort of protective custody protective order a pfa could be significant the nine of wands speaks about being wounded i don't know maybe somebody wore themselves out for some of you somebody could have been in a fight or they're arrested they, they got arrested in the midst of about to do this here or whatever they try to do somebody found out what they try to do somebody reported this person high priestess in reverse somebody not willing to keep this person secrets but for some of y'all it's a feminine here who's been involved with this she's telling this person secrets four wines in reverse this is somebody who who a masculine got a divorce with or something like that something could have this masculine could already have domestic violence charges or abuse 
or something like that on him. He could, or he, he gets intoxicated, drinking and fighting and violence in a home. For some of y'all, this masculine has recently been in an accident, could be hospitalized or something like that. Give me one for the, um, for the three of wands here. Wait until I tag that clip. We got the six of cups. Some of y'all, this is somebody in y'all family, or it's like a specific memory from this person's childhood, more than likely that they seen with their dad. Somebody grew up with an abusive dad, as you can see. Somebody's very nostalgic here. Something that they seen in their childhood, they never been able to get over it. And I feel like actually this is a man who um, replicated his father's behaviors. All right, but his cycle is closing for this masculine, whoever this person is here, because his, his journey is being stopped with the three of wands. He has nothing to look forward to moving forward. The devil, this could be a Capricorn, but I'm telling you somebody here is obsessed with some sort of memory or something that happened in his childhood, Page of Cups, but he's been replaying these scenarios out. But I'm telling you, look, Ten of Swords, this masculine is being told on. It's a betrayal here. Is an ending, a major ending that's um that's coming. For some of y'all, this masculine could have been on drugs since their youth years. Here I come. They're trying to go through some sort of healing or something like that here with the with the star. This could be an Aquarius or a Capricorn has betrayed an Aquarius or something like that. King of Cups in reverse. A manipulative masculine. Like I said, something that he's been exposed to. Um the star speaks about hope and healing and things of that nature. Somebody really wished that they could have healed a, a relationship with their father. This is between a father and a son, or this ain't a father and a son. This is like, a um, look, Page of Wands, childhood inspiration. His father was the inspiration to how he's been acting. This could be a water sign masculine or an Aquarius, a Capricorn, a Taurus. Could be a Pisces here or a Virgo. Could be a Gemini. Somebody has un yes. All right, un or Cancer unhealed wounds with a father. Now, for some of y'all, the saddest part about all of this is, is that when this masculine finally started to heal, this is when he met a spouse that he's been interested in. But with the Six of Cups, it's something that's coming up from his past. That's not um that's not been resolved. And I feel like others are getting blamed for three of swords. Something's resurfacing from somebody's childhood information, the inspiration behind these crimes and what he's been doing. And at this point, at this time right now, this masculine could be in a relationship, could be married, yet with an empress or have somebody pregnant. But whoever this person is, maybe raising a baby alone. Let's see. Give me one next to the Empress. This woman is going to feel betrayed once she hears about what came out, what's coming out about her man. Yeah, the woman could be pregnant with the Page of Cups. Or the woman is very intuitive. Somebody's intuitive here. Y'all know the Page of Cups could speak about um, psychic abilities and download spiritual stuff here with the Page of Cups. Is a feminine figure here um, who's getting nudges to walk away. She's seeing something in a dream state. Yep, Six of Wands about some sort of exposure about her man. Let's go ahead and close this out here. Close this out. Somebody about to ask they love her. Can they switch states with them or something? We got mirroring. This got something to do with a father. A father. He mirrored, mirrored a father's behaviors. Get down. Who ghosted him? All right. I feel like this empress has spiritual protection at this time. We got energy cleanse. All right. We got dazed and confused. Generous offer. Somebody may be trying to come with a peace offer. And this could be by spring. Um... For some of you guys, uh, mirroring, shh, energy cleanse. Let's see. Give me one for mirroring. Separation. Yeah, it's some sort of ending here. Something like turned the masculine cold. Give me one for, um, or he disregards these women, how, how his father did him. He had an abusive father. Give me one here for energy cleanse. We got inner strength. Somebody had a hard time here fighting this addiction or whatever they got going on here, what they do to women. Give me one for days they confused. 
We have autumn, one for days and confused. We have fear and anxiety. September, October, November months is when this masculine started having a lot of fear about this here that's coming out. Some of y'all, this is somebody who you separated from. Somebody had cameras put in your home or they felt like they needed to watch you for some sort of reason. Meaningful coincidences. We have self-love. We have slow and steady. And we have open up. Healthy boundaries at the bottom of the deck. Soulmate, counsel, and therapy. Somebody hates women. Or it's something here that somebody did that they was married to. Who left them scorned? But somebody here created some sort of healthy boundaries. You started your self-love journey, self-worth. You're taking things slow with a specific love interest or something like that. For some of y'all, I'm hearing this could have been his partner or somebody here who he does these things with. Somebody's reporting him. All right. Somebody's reporting this masculine. Yeah, somebody want romance with a feminine. All right. There's some sort of sorority with men, bitter men who hate women. We got abundance. Yeah, some of y'all, I feel like somebody here is about to get a payout in regards to this here. We got remain positive, and then we have trust. If this happened to you, you reported cameras in, in your home or something like that, it's going to be a peaceful resolution. Somebody know what you're saying here is true. And we have the situation will improve. It's actually proof on this because whoever this person works with turned them in. Because somebody gave somebody advice that they did not listen to. Somebody carried through to something that they just told not to do. Yeah, behavior and interpretations. He likes to study women or something like that. Look, vulnerability and empathy. He can like set little scenarios up and then he want to see how they respond after he do these things to him. He's sick. 16 or 9 could be significant. 25. Yeah, he want to see what a woman will do when she feels vulnerable and emotional or... He likes the, them scare tactics. Y'all seen the nine of wands. He likes to scare women. We got boundaries and respect. A very forceful man. And he hates rejection. S secrets are coming out about him. He's false. And he is being exposed. He, he, he won't be. He can't sit in the seat. Acting like he's official. Knowing what he's out here doing to women. And I'm also hearing rejection is God's protection. Let's go ahead and close this out. There's nothing but truths coming out about this mask going with the Ace of Swords. And look, with the Three of Wands, it's like he's sitting back waiting for the truth. He knows some truth coming out about him. Close this out. Inner Peace card. We got two. We got Pay the Piper and Move On. Drop Dead. I mean, Drop and Give Me Zen. All right. Yeah, somebody owes somebody here. We got Pay the Piper. Drop and give me zen. Somebody wants peace here. And we got activate pure mantra. The power of meow. I'm going to go ahead and leave it there, y'all. I know this won't resonate with everybody. But if any of this message here resonated with you today, like, share, and subscribe. Take care.